Gamers, gamers, one and all, welcome to Monkey Island. Oh yeah, it is the return to the return to Monkey Island again. Oh. Where we three gorgeous babies will be bringing to you entertainment replete with Lee's content. Because Lee oh. worked on this game! I Shipping generated it. this content for you. Oh my <laughs> god. This, content. this is UG UGC. I'm Sean yeah. Plot. LGC. I'm Lee, Generation Content Grainer. <laughs> and I'm Sean Bouchard. Welcome back to Mostly Walking. We're so thrilled to have you join us as we play, honestly, a genre of game yeah. that just never stops giving. It never stops giving. It never giving. does. Yeah. It's true. Once you understand yeah. what it is that you are to be receiving, it never stops yeah. giving that. It's so good. Yeah. Yeah, because, yeah. like, oh my God, it's like with romance novels. You know that it's trash. You know that you're not listening to top tear top people are talking about. You know this game is hair, garbage. So top you know this game yeah. is <laughs> no, no, like, shit. like you know that you're gonna get stuck for like 30 minutes on a ridiculous puzzle. You know that at sure. some point the quality is gonna degrade to a near zero quality bar level because they ran out of budget. You know that these kinds of things are common in the genre. They're not necessarily guaranteed, but is they're that... fucking tropes. I I wonder. I wonder if you're going to see that here because I'm I'm too close to it. I don't presume to be able to speak on the quality of this project, but I do wonder if you're going to see a bit of a drop off. But I don't think so because like this game was made by complete professionals, and by yeah. that I mean that it was like it was not made from beginning to end. <laughs> Right, yeah, <laughs> right. Like so many of the games that we play. It's, this yeah, is it's not, very important to leave. That's right. This is yeah. not Toonstruck. Yeah, this is uh, the yeah. We're playing here. So for any of you who are curious what the what the hell we're talking about, I should have said, heck, YouTube demonetized a game. Oh um, no! Oh, and I wanted this one to go far. I don't give even the slightest fuck about my YouTube, okay? Oh. <laughs> I, will, I will simply <laughs> upload whatever happens here and be fine with that. So, um, in, in uh, modern game dev, you typically make a sort of set of foundational tools, and underneath that, you can just kind of plop in repeated styles of content. So, you know, the most- Those uh, tools are the employees. Yeah, like, like the most- <laughs> You know, the most simple is, hey, look at an open world game. You have tools to be able to place various objects, various human paths. And yeah, different art is going to be in this town than in that town. But you can have two different design teams work in parallel. In right. early games, I mean, literally, it was just like you'd write the code for this five minutes and then this five minutes and then this five minutes. And you'd like sequentially build the code. And the, fi the foundational stuff was so minimal. It was so right. much custom, one-off shit. It was the best, man. Oh, it yeah. was done completely in vertical slices. That's why, like, <laughs> like the first. So, like, when they, when, when, when that guy was coding up Super Mario Brothers, he did the first screen, and then he wrote the music for that screen, <laughs> and then. <laughs> As, no. Okay, yeah. but this like yeah. genuinely, this reminds me not to imply that uh, classic game game developers from the 1990s uh, yeah. were this, but for me, when I first learned how to program, when I, I learned is too strong a word, but my first programming was with oh. QBasic. Oh, Shout out to yeah! QBasic. Fuck yeah! Fuck yeah! That's my first language. Uh, and I had uh, not only no formal training, but this was before the internet existed. So there was yeah. not like a, a good way to teach yourself fucking anything. We were just like, we were just, you know, thrown yeah. around all kinds of nonsense. And uh, anyway, the point is I was making uh, role playing games in QBasic and I did not understand what loops were. So I oh. just... I just copied and pasted the code for like, here is a prompt for the player to go in a direction oh, over and over oh, and over again, a hundred yep. times linearly, yep. literally just like yep. for oh. each node in like a, 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 a map. <laughs> um, here's that exact code copied and pasted I, over again. And, and for any of you that <laughs> yeah. didn't know this, the, the way that a lot of uh, scripting worked back in QBasic is like, in, in modern code, you would do something, you know, where you'd have like your your main function, which is like what starts your game. Yeah. And, yeah. And, you know, and 
in here you might have call this function and this will then have this function down here you know to to actually allow you to right. do stuff yeah back then oh yeah and what's nice about this and of course i know there's i need to be pedantic because we have coders in chat what's nice about this is that if for some reason you add more stuff here it's fine because call this function is called here and then there you go and it's totally fine and you might be going well of course how else would it work let me tell you how basic and too basic worked you had line numbers so it'd be like one oh, two boy. three four five six seven eight nine ten and if you wanted to run the code here instead of having a function name you just down here would write go to three Oh. And it would just go up here. So, like, if for some reason you needed to, like, add some lines here, like, if here is where, you know, thing A and thing B and thing C happened, mm -hmm. if you, like, yep. added in a line like this, you had to be, like, really careful to make sure that this got changed to go to four. Because everything would I be mean, moved down. Well, down. and for that reason, you would never number the lines one, two, three, four. You would, at the very least, do, like, 10, 20, 30, 40. So that if you needed to insert nine more yeah. lines in between them, it was possible to do that. Yeah. QBasic was not that bad. That was the original basic. That is 100% how it worked. Oh, yeah. Oh, Q yeah. QBasic included that for backwards uh, compatibility, but it didn't require it. Like, you could call functions. If you knew what functions were, right. little Sean yeah. did not. Yep. yep. Oh, yeah. See, I grew up on HyperCard, so I had the one big book on the shelf. <laughs> Hell <laughs> and, yes. Uh, Hell yes. And, uh, God. Well, I, you, yes, all you so, were doing was trying to understand that author. That was the coolest part <laughs> of text. There's no, there was no notion of the knowledge base. There's the no the notion of how Doug West thinks I should code my shit. Like, I mean, I I did like when I first encountered a game loop. That was um, the first time I encountered a, a main loop of a game was uh, Mortal Wombat, which was a, a hypercard stack that Amazing. I downloaded off the Amazing. internet, and and it was the things kept moving. I was used to you click a button and something uh -huh. happens. Yes. But the things kept moving. It was like they were alive and I was like, how are they doing this? <laughs> how are they so doing it? The, the loop isn't ending. Fucking magic. Magic. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it, was, it, was, it was amazing. Oh, it's so good. Well, uh, to be clear, that's exactly how this game was made. We're going to be continuing yep, to play true. through Return to Monkey Island. I think that, that is a good enough intro for the day. Mm. And um, let's just slam it in there. Get that segue going. We're going to hop right into the game. And if we just look sequentially, this was on the 31st at 2054. Ooh. Do you remember where we oh, were? Oh, that's right. Halloween show. Oh, yeah. Woo. Because woo. last week I said I'm not going to work today. And uh, just canceled the show. <laughs> so it was great. Uh, hey, remind me. Of where we were this is the greatest technology that a game has ever it really out. is like what a fucking feature this i i, I hope to god this yeah. gets adopted by every uh not so just good. adventure game developer game. but every game developer Hi, every Dad. and not just games okay so that's right i want my movie safe at the voodoo shop and I was if I pause a movie on Netflix, I want Netflix to know that it's been sure a week since I watched the first the half more, of uh, but I was sure oh, that's up fucking tight. Elaine was setting up yeah. disaster relief for earthquake victims. There was a lot to think about, but I was keeping my to-do list up to date, and the main thing was finding those golden keys. Oh, he even throws to the to-do list. Yeah, he does. Yeah, look at look at my cat. Hey, oh, my cat. these golden keys. So as they, oh, it's as, a buddy. As was said before, on an errand back soon. Well, Darn it. if we could go in here, it would show us okay. that there is the lock safe that has five golden. That's keys. right. That's right. Five golden key holes. And they told are... us where most of them are in general terms, right? Oh yeah. So yeah. So it should be really this. easy. It should be. So super it's gonna be really. Yeah. This is gonna be extremely straightforward. The the last. This last little bit of the game is going to just be yeah, this taking is... up the keys from various screens, I think. And so the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to go get a map of the sea right down here. Hello. Hey, Wally. Hi, Wally. Do you have a sea map of the local you area? Do you have a sea map of the local area? 
can you jot down the locations of Terror Island and Bermuda? No problem. I'll also add a few extras. The ship track feature is going to blow your mind. It's a little trick I know. <laughs> you need to be able to go the extra oh. mile if you want to make it in the big oh time God. like me. Look at that cute cat. I well, know. Apple, Look at the that. The pirates I made a map to Terror Island for were never seen again. And Bermuda can chill you to the bone. Not many pirates want to head up there. Oh, and when you get to Scurvy Island, say hi to Elaine for me. Thanks, Wally. And sorry about blowing you up that one time. Hmm. <laughs> By the way, this this cat, both cats like being hugged now. They both wait until Aww. I just pull them. Look at that. Look how your nose fits directly onto yeah. the forehead That's of that cat. That's so good. Yeah. So that just... little head press. Yeah, and then look we can... <laughs> yeah, looking yep. up. Yeah. That's so cute. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ideal cat behavior there. Yeah, I mean, yeah. she just... And, and if I stop, she kind of like and... starts rubbing against stuff and starts digging her claws into me until I give her another hug. It's really nice. Yeah, I gotta it's get that. She's, she has the most incredible expression on her face when she's getting... You mean yep. an absolutely empty look combined yep. with total relaxation? Like a... Yep. Like, predators don't exist kind of expression. Isn't that yeah. right? <laughs> There's no risks. There's no risks. This, mm. this little one has wanted a lot of hugs today. I've gotten very little done. Oh. Good mm. content. All right. Good content happening yeah. here. All right. Let's socialize <laughs> out of carnivore instincts. That is right, Lay GG. If only my dog had been socialized in that same way. <laughs> Little dogs are like ruff ruff ruff, and Cece's like snacks. <laughs> All right, so let's see here. We got this map. Oh, of the wait sea. Until I'm back on my ship to open it. All right, so let's go this way. It's got ship tracking, so. Yeah, Hell yeah! No Look at that. way! Oh my god! It's like King's Quest Six, where Hell ship yeah, is suddenly up. absolutely impossible to make progress in. Is there actual um, panning? No! Look at, it, look at it bounce around. It bounces you so didn't, nicely. You didn't know this was an open world game. If that's true, if that's what you can call that. I made it myself. I love that. It's a I love this. this Just a scream. Point. The law this is a good screen. You're carrying limes before I allow you to proceed. All right, more. great. This is the terror. Like, look at the Did look I... at the ocean you're sailing on. <laughs> <laughs> Did I already tell you the story about limes? Looks like mm -mm. you left a I don't know. Limes on your other ship. So it turns Due out, scurvy, like there was, there was like a bout of scientific like exploration in uh, in the back. English Navy, to do so uh, where they, you know, scurvy was a problem, and yeah, the new yeah. scurvy was a problem, and they're trying to figure out like, what do we do about this? What the fuck is going on? And they figured out that if you drink, uh, like, f like lemon juice, uh, it will combat scurvy. And it was it was kind of remarkably difficult to figure that out, uh -huh. but they eventually did, and they figured it out, right. and it totally cured it scurvy. And uh, it was it was brilliant. It and then they spell. said, well, power limes are it basically just cheap lemons, keys. right? We don't even yeah. know where to start. It could take uh, forever. And so they started <gasps> using limes, and it turns out limes don't I really work. For power oh spells, shit! But it's so not on this like the that whole no premise. We can craft it was there totally flawed. Here. We'll take my ship. Oh my god. So stay here to keep an eye We're on gonna have to patch the game. And steal the secret yourself? You're gonna have to. I don't yeah. think so. Well, but they that's what they did. They were all like limes, limes no it is. One trusts okay, so to stay behind. Let me let me take a we'll really cynical bit where someone on this. else finds out the thing is here. The only map is lost somewhere. Well, hold on, we gotta island. we gotta we gotta get caught up here. Probably eaten by a wild boar by now. Because we've got some baddies. It's here. We do I have some And they're working together. With him anyway. I'm thinking maybe one of the large ones in the leg. <laughs> <laughs> and we've got some good good LeChuck content. That's, and then, that's yeah. good LeChuck content. Okay. okay. I, I could see you. How did you find me? I just sailed up and here you were. Who are you? I'm <laughs> Guybrush Threepwood, Mighty Pirate. Are you alone? No, I mean that, that that comment about like, oh my god, 
Lemons stop scurvy? What's a cheaper alternative? Limes? Well, they taste kind of similar. They, they taste kind of similar. They must be doing the same shit. And I feel like yeah. that is a great example of when you have like MBAs making creative decisions for companies. Right. right? Where it's just like, well, right. Candy Crush yep. is a match three game. So let's just yeah. make like a simpler match two game. Then that way we can get even more Dude, people in. Right? That will be two thirds the cost. <laughs> <laughs> but it, I, and and there's probably a lesson in this too. Like it, the it coincided approximately with I think the adoption of steam, uh, ship like steam locomotion and chips. And the deal with scurvy is that you do not get affected by scurvy for like four months, right? right? Like you can go without vitamin C for four months and you are totally unaffected. Yeah. And then after that, it sets in. And the thing about steamships is that, like, they move fast enough that you're you're not really on the water for four months, more than four months at a time. Oh. So they just never figured out that the limes weren't working. Like, they had everybody take limes, oh, huh. and nobody got scurvy, and they were like, therefore, we did it. Yeah. Oh, my God. Shit. Uh, and they really sort of like the the where I learned about all of this is with the South Pole expedition where they like go to the South Pole and they do a wow. whole thing and they're trying to get there and they're out for a lot longer than four months and all of a sudden everybody gets scurvy again. Oh, they're like, shit. we thought we solved this. We have all of this lime juice uh, <laughs> and it's totally useless. That's so that's a good. bummer for them. Yeah. At the moment. Wow. Thank goodness. Never go to a poll. I'm Ned Filigree, accountant. That's that. I, I think that's rude. probably it's just accurate. That I'm in hiding. What is it you're afraid of? Who is it you're afraid of? Well, have you heard of Stan S. Stanman? Name sounds familiar. Thank goodness they locked him away on Bermuda. He'll be chipping ice in the quarry for a long, long time. I can't help but be nervous, but actually, I guess I've got decades before I really have to worry about it. One thing I really like about this transition, because we, we took two weeks between when we got back to the town and now to where mm -hmm. we're here, but like, I thought that what was happening is that we had a bunch of experience on um, Melee Island, and then we got to um, Monkey Island, and then back to mm -hmm. Melee Island. And that can sometimes be exciting to revisit an old location when it's changed, but like, I was sort of like, oh, I guess we're going to end some more familiar. And then, no, it just balloons back up into, like, the entire <laughs> seascape. Oh, yeah. Really... <laughs> How come you're afraid of Stan? He's always struck me as pretty harmless, except economically. Sure, but you never can tell what someone like Stan will do. He's got no moral center. Here's that term again. Like I said, I'm glad he's <laughs> safely stuck in the Bermuda Quarry for a good long time. Dude, the clouds have, like, little bendies. Yeah. Where did you say they were keeping Stan again? The ice quarry on Bermuda. He'll be there for years. And... You must be good at math. I'm a creative accountant. <laughs> math doesn't really enter into it. You any good? Don't judge like me that. about where I live. That's I've good. just had a few setbacks. It's all I can afford right now, but it's temporary. Oh, shit. There's a trivia card there. I'm on a quest to recover oh, fuck. the secret of Monkey Oh, shit. I can't wait to guess That's some shit. That's a good move. I've heard the secret is a one-of-a-kind intangible, which means you can assign it whatever value you want to. Also, <laughs> since it's very old, you can claim a lot of depreciation. Wait, are you trying to tell me I'm going to have to pay taxes on the secret? Not if you're smart about it. <laughs> I'm going to explore the... Holler if you find anything interesting. Oh, hell yeah. Easy it's time. Man. The Mad Monkey was a giant robotic monkey, a sunken ship, the leader of the pirates of Danger Co., LeChuck's pet chimp. Oh. The Mad Monkey. I don't know. I'm going to guess. Oh, I love I'm that. I'm going to guess not, not one. One seems too obvious. Yeah. Uh... Uh, I guess two. I guess sunken yeah. ship. Like, like, a sunken ship was my intuition, or LeChuck's ship. Oh my god! Guessing works! 
Guessing yes. is how it's done. Yes. Let's go to Vegas. Vegas. And bet an entire ship. That's a mighty fine looking chest you have there. What's in it? Everything I own. The fruits of a man's life. The yardstick by which I'll be measured when I'm gone. It's mainly paperwork. Nice <laughs> <laughs> likeness of you. Where's the other half? No comment. Can I have the picture? No, that would be weird. <laughs> All right. He's in jail for years. So we can go past the 19th parallel. Well, sail to an adrift ship. Ooh, actually, okay. Where, where, where do y'all want to go? Oops. I can click on myself. Mm. This is certainly mm. exciting. Can you go to, yeah, climb down. Just in a generic spot. Oh my god, I only have <laughs> four minutes. This is really deep. I've already been diving for four <sighs> minutes. I've got to turn back now, or I won't be able to hold my breath long enough to return to the surface. Okay, all that right. That is the scariest idea I have ever put myself into, is climbing downward on a chain with my breath held for four minutes. I don't even think I can play Subnautica again. Like... <laughs> oh, you're right. not going to like the whole part of this game, then. That's the underwater oh, horror uh, <laughs> anglerfish part. Oh, shit. <laughs> Oh boy. Now we've Shit. done it. Can't believe we've done oh, this. Fuck. This is oh. really deep. I've already been diving for four minutes. Okay. I've got to okay. turn back now, or I won't be able to hold my breath long enough to return to the surface. By the comedy rule of threes, if you do that again, it'll be funny. <laughs> By the comedy rules of two, I like to build anticipation. By the comedy power of Grayskull, ah, I have the I'm power. I'm not even mortal, and I'm feeling the minutes tick away. All right. So, okay, we need to go to Terror Island, right? That's a place. Yeah. Yeah, but that's a scary place. It does look scary. On we, the other hand, I am the mayor of Terror Island. I'm pretty sure that we're going to need to convince Stan to let us break him out of prison. Oh, yeah. I'm not sure why. Exactly, but that seems like a puzzle that is being set up. Um, well, we need to find ourselves some lines. Oh, I'm trivia card! Sure Fuck yeah, let's where. go! Oh hell yeah! Oh, fuck this is yeah. the game. This is the whole fucking the game. Features Bella Fisher's ship. I think it's just a dog. I don't Salt remember Lager. Bella Fisher. Do you remember who Bella Fisher is? Oh, I mean, I do. fucking did it, man! Nailed it. Oh. Yeah, Lee, oh. I, I figure you know all of this. Lee's a trivia fiend in general. Tri trivia fiend. This place doesn't like visitors. Death waits for all who enter. I'd turn back if I were ye. That's encouraging. Yeah, I better not get any closer. I'd turn ah, back Papa if Pichu. I were ye. That hurts. Papa Pichu. Okay, poisonous. Papa Pichu. Papa, Papa Pichu. Pichu. All right. Brave the Dark Twisted Forest. Here I go. I can hold tab, it's so nice. To an unlucky Good. place. Ooh. To a twisting path, to a mysterious clearing, to a bizarre grove, to a slimy grotto. Ooh, bizarre, 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 bizarre. Bizarre grove. Dude, let me tell you, these are all Magic the Gathering card names. Like, these, <laughs> these are these are duels. These are dual lands. These are all right? dual lands, like, yeah. Bizarre grove has got to be like uh -huh. blue green. Mysterious sure. clearing, this is black white. Ooh, Slimy yes. grotto. This is black, or this is green, red, black. Wait, actually, maybe, maybe. Yeah, green, black, black, green, red. right? Okay. And green, this is blue. an unlucky place. This, I mean, this is black, blue, blue black? for sure. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Yeah. A twisting path is probably green, red, black, black, green. Yeah, green, red. Oh, okay. Oh, I would have thought like white, red. Oh, interesting. Oh. For a dead tree, it's a little too lively. Just a dead end. Sounds a little creepy if you think. For a oh. dead tree, it's a little too lively. Dude, I'm fucking. Fuck yes, I love this tab box. Yeah. Dina is the blank reigning queen of Muta. I mean, I'm gonna go for nine for branding. 
Oh my god, guessing fucking owns. You're so good at this game. You're so good. We and got three in a good. row, which means that we can't lose. You can't lose. Dude. It's the rule of threes. That's the rule. Hey, Vamp Doll Bites, thanks for the raid. We're on a streak. Oh, sweet. Party of four. Oh, that's Hell adorable. Yeah. That's like a <laughs> that's like it. a that's a four top uh, in your uh, in your little restaurant here, Sean. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. We have a table for you all right here. Hell yeah! Ooh. All right, to the mysterious clearing. Oh, love this! Love me a, a clearing. Grizzly skeleton. Ugh. Looks like he Ooh, had the grizzly. wrong person watching his back. But really, I'm not sure I want. Oh, wait, know I don't. Looks I like can't the wrong person that. watching his back. Does he have a stab really wound, wound in his eye? Why do these pirates look familiar? No, he is face down with a bullet in the back of his head. Oh, it's the back of the skull. I get it. You know I what I it. think it is that makes that a bit confusing is that his tricorner hat got like rotated. It 90 did. Degrees. Well, and it's just that like the 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 top vertebra of his neck kind of looked like a chin. Oh, oh I see. Yeah. Do you see that? Like that's what <laughs> I, I was. Do you see at. that? Yeah. I'm not sure, I want to know what happened here. I'll be fine as long as I don't lose my wits and keep my head. It looks really old and dry. So you can probably light this. I'm pretty oh, proud of the pun that's, that's coming up. All right. Ooh, I'm so it's excited. Yeah. Lamp with a I'll let you know when. <clears throat> Looks like another greedy pirate who met a sordid fate. Yeah. That. That's a good <laughs> pun. Fuck. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, that's really God good. God damn it, Lee. Yeah. Fuck yeah. yeah. Oh, we got fucking trivia oh, cards, man. I love Tab. Good God. Herman Toothrot first appears in LeChuck's Revenge here in Monkey Island. Curse Monkey Island escaped from Monkey Island. Not secret of Monkey Island. I think it's this one. Oh, Damn. guessing Damn is it. so shit. You'd be wrong. It's like another greedy pirate who met a sordid fate. Yeah. Oh, there this it is. Give me the creeps. Oh, <laughs> wow. God damn it. And it's so like um subtle. Uh, what Yeah, it's subtle, but it's also like what's that dry, I guess? Like that yeah. style where you just kind of like run right over the joke. I mean, I don't know if the I don't know whether the uh voice actor knew it was a joke. You know. I, it it kind of doesn't matter. Kind of doesn't whatever matter. Whatever it is, I don't think it wants me around. Dude, it's that rock monster. I love monster. the music here, too. Oh, Vio. You guys know Dark Ooh. Crystal? Excuse me? Oh, oh I, I have to watch that again. I haven't watched it in a long time. God, yeah, Yelling it's been it. forever since I watched the that. The Nebring. Yeah, man. Uh, there's no such thing as a man-eating mushroom, right? Oh, can we also just pay attention to the lighting in this room as we go through it? Yeah, no, it just Because that's fun. It is very, yeah, it's super fun. It's really nice. It's getting hard to tell the flora from the fauna. Arg. It says X Y Z Z Y. Zizzy. I can't quite get it off of there. It's locked. It's locked. It says X. I can't quite get it off of there. All right, so now we're gonna. It's getting hard to tell the flora from the fauna. Uh, there's no such thing as a man-eating mushroom, right? Mm -hmm. I think all, right. all mushrooms are man-eating if you give them the chance. <laughs> oh, <laughs> shit, you're right. You don't move. <laughs> trivia card, dude, let me tell you. Tab and trivia. Which <laughs> of these the cannot be found on the ocean floor? Oh, oh fuck. God. Okay, wait, what did we do last time? I think we said we a failed geyser crab? last time. That's what we did. Did we do crab? I think we did a Cal geyser. Did we do... Fuck. We gotta keep track of this. <laughs> Cause we're gonna guess the same thing a second time. Um <clears throat> I guess kelp? Cause kelp needs the sun, right? Well, I need somebody. I'm doing kelp. Oh my god! Okay, I'm you writing down. Fucked. Memento style. I'm just gonna write down yeah, not like slow crashing help. wave of spores. Okay, and I'm gonna In get that tattooed places, onto my forearm. There are mushrooms. I wrote these rooms too. I think I I did <clears throat> like pretty much all of Terror Island. I mean, other people wrote stuff in the rooms, but I wrote the. If there's anything that's inconsequential and slightly it's entertaining, I probably wrote keys, it. But yeah, any I believe key it. is a good key in my book. It's a fucking key. 
I'm sure I'm a more skilled survivalist and have nothing to worry about. I'll Trivia just card. keep telling sure. myself that. Uh, this place gives me that lonely feeling. Where can you find brambles? Terror Island. Sure. Yeah, that's really great. It's like what's happening right in front of you. And I'm like, this? And it's like, good <laughs> job. And I'm like, I love school. Good <laughs> job. Yeah. Although I'm getting my hair cut tomorrow morning, and therefore I have the right to poof my hair the night before as much as possible. What I've discovered is that as, as I'm balding, I'm discovering that this, like yeah. this hair that grows out just on the yeah, other side of where I'm balding, one, yeah. this is like way longer than any other hair on my head. Like I don't have oh, this yep. correspondingly, but like it grows from the side and it like, like I guess I mean, eventually to... that, that one is going to be your hair, Sean. I think this is it. Like, this is just literally one <laughs> spike. That's where you're getting to. I mean, look, it's like fucking long, man. It's like really but good. But you see it's already curling around. Like, give that a little more time, and it's going to do a whole curl. Oh, yeah. that's right. It's gonna that's going to be my whorl. Your, Your whorl. whorl. My, wh yeah. my whole world is Your a whorl. <laughs> All right, so we're going to go to the twisting path. We're going to use the key. Oh, wait. Do you think the key is for... It's locked. Well, there wasn't a keyhole, but it did say it was locked, which makes me wonder. I think the lock must be under that sign. Ah, uh, damn it. We need, like, a crowbar. Crowbar. Crowbar or some acid. Or a knife. Oh! Yeah, hard Fuck mode. yeah. Did it. Fuck yeah, hard mode. What what happens in easy mode? I mean... Can you just take the thing you off? You could just take the sign. That's that's one of the least that's one of the least sophisticated uh, difficulty I've modes. The key losses. doesn't fit. <laughs> this key doesn't fit. Wrong Wait, key. Which... Oh. oh God. Okay. Wait, I... what happened? It's not a. Stress me the fuck out. Oh. oh. I, <laughs> ah! I was, see. I had a little dungeon master freak out there for a minute because it, <laughs> it does have. Some <laughs> I have some matches. Do we have matches, or is there a fire somewhere that we can find and light that was a light a lamp? Game. It's too dark to see anything. All right, so we need matches. It's getting hard to tell the flora from the fauna. Is there an exit? I, I'm doing this, all this shit. Fuck yeah, let's do it. <laughs> this is hilarious. I'm supposed to enjoy the game. This little light of mine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna let it shine. Um, Terror. Oh, so Terror Island is actually. Product. It's kind of interesting. Terror Island is one of the only places that like. Yes, we do. There's. That like. S there's slightly worse uh, quality of life, in there. You know what I mean. As from a game design perspective. Ah. Mm. Scurvy Island. Oh, this I is see. This Elaine's been growing yeah. all the limes for the Marley Foundation Scurvy Project. She's probably back Fuck here yeah. by now. I can't wait to see her. I love that little star baby. I know, it's very cute. Unnecessary this, polish. Like I, This island is, yeah. I want to make a company where we talk about the company values and they're like two very reasonable things and then unnecessary polish. It's like I mean, look at that snail. Value. <laughs> yes. Bravely... Bravely making its way across that little sand beach. Yeah. It says trying to find a, a place to plop down its home. And Prevention League, or <coughs> STAPL, Staple. welcomes you to Scurvy Island, 1.5 miles to STAPL headquarters. Staple HQ. Oh shit! Trivia card. We got the tab. Ooh. Hell Dude. yeah! I thought I saw that. That's good. Wally Shop is on High Street, isn't it? Yeah, the Low Street is the one. Okay. What? Do Fuck. I not know High Street from Low Street? Wait. It's a very realistic likeness of the I thought High Street was like where the voodoo. I didn't know Elaine was into woodworking. <laughs> yeah, I thought that was High Street. I thought that. that was High Street. I guess it's Low Street. Thanks, Bird. Um, well, let me put it this way. Every time when I was working on the game, I would need to work on High Street or Low Street. I always got them mixed up. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> Aww. Look how cute! It's the doorbell. It's so cute. Oh my god, there's all these places we can go to. There's just so this many is, I mean, there's a ton of them. This is not what this is, but this reminds me of my favorite thing in video games, and I think Stan's shirt does do this, is when wow. you have a texture 
that mm -hmm. uh, is to to tied to world coordinates. Any limes from the uh, yes. I've worked so hard to set up. That is my favorite thing. That's my favorite graphical effect in all of video games. It's really good. Sloop beard. <laughs> I'm gonna guess Art. Reginald. Damn it! I, I I heard Lee say Sloop beard, and I was like, developer says. Sloop beard. <laughs> I'll never tell you. This. I'll never tell. That's where all the driftwood goes. I love that one. I, driftwood that's a that's one of my favorite jokes. I didn't write it. I mean, oh, I love that place. It's I like mean, favorite jokes. Candy cane. I got swept over the edge one time. Good thing Elaine knows that the emerged Elaine and I uh, whole cloth sometimes. out of the game engine. Elaine and I debate about whether it looks like a parrot or a cockatoo. Go, 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 go. Elaine and I debate about whether it go, looks like go, a parrot go. or Elaine. Are you decent? Hello? Stave remover. I pinched a yak with it once, and then I sort of accidentally pinched the staple remover. I had it for years before I remembered to give it back to Elaine. She was happy and mad at the same time. Mappy. Hi, <laughs> I'm working due east of Parrot Rock and due north of the waterfall today. All right, nice. Hey. This used to be a picture of both of us. What happened to the me part? Uh oh. Uh oh. Why does that look like uh -oh. half a picture? Let me tell you. Why do I feel like I recently saw another half a picture? This is a rough way um, to really discover stuff. You're... I know this is that is the uh, the sort of the the most uh, arcane Dear John letter I've ever seen. Is how you find well, out. Well, you know what it is. It's like I don't want to spoil anything, but it turns out that you are uh, Ned's son. Pirates used to have to steal and to Elaine's to prove son. Themselves. No, at least that's Ned what they and told Elaine's they son. Me do it. Yep. Um, and so it's is nicely dried, pre your son and ready to go. And right, and my son is also Elaine's son, so and Ned's son, because um, you're Ned. Because I'm Ned. You and Ned are son dads. I Elaine. think it's going to turn out that we were Bruce Willis the whole time. Cherished mementos. Um, do you know about son dads? I don't know what son dads are. Logan and one of his friends came up with this idea for a sitcom These where two college bros marry each other's moms and they become son dads. <laughs> Oh, oh my god. god, that's so Why? stupid. <laughs> I'm working due east of Paris and due north of the waterfall today. Oh, due north of the waterfall. Uh... Hi. Hi. I was hoping I'd run into you again. I was hoping that too. What happened at the voodoo shop? Sun dads. Did you get the secret? There was a complication. Isn't there always? A big, heavy, rectangular complication with five keyholes and a secret inside. Well, that sounds daunting. What about LeChuck and Captain Madison? They weren't there, oddly enough. Well, be careful. They're hey, probably conspiring against me. The yeah. project has hit a snag. We have plenty of limes, as you can see, but people are refusing to take them. Oh, we'll them. take those limes they off your hand, dude. Like Hell taste, yeah. And they don't believe they'll help with scurvy. As an elected official, I could have issued an edict, but as a private citizen, I have to convince people. I tried this flyer. Wow. Yeah, I've this read is... part of this. I know, I, I know it's terribly dry, but the facts are there. Oh my God. I don't know if I, 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 wow. I'm certain I told you guys about this, that at USC, I went to the, like the on-campus medical clinic thing. And okay. they had this like four page thing that was like, read this. And I was like, all right, next, 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 next. It was on this like digital interface. Mm -hmm. And I was like, all right, thanks so much. We'll be with you shortly. And a woman came down and was like, Oh, uh, you're supposed to be in the upstairs waiting room, like 30 minutes later. And I was like, oh, okay. So I went up there, and then they like brought me into the room, and then they were like doctoring away at me or whatever. And this woman comes in and goes, excuse me, were you the gentleman who was waiting downstairs instead of going upstairs? And I went, yeah, yeah, that's me. And she goes, well, why were you waiting downstairs? 
And I said, well, you know, when, when you enter, it's, just, it's the waiting room. So I just waited in the waiting room when I was done because I said, wait in the waiting room. She said, well, in those four pages, it very clearly says that you should be going upstairs. And I went, oh, yeah, I didn't read that. And she was like, well, you should read it. And I'm like, oh, well, I'm never going to read that shit. <laughs> and like, and, yeah. and and that was the discussion mm -hmm. where she was like, "But it's written," and I was like, "But I'm never, ever gonna <laughs> read that ever." Yeah, that's, yep, yeah, that's yep. it. And and but like this, this is her ancestor, right here. Yeah, mm. yeah. Have it's you tried true. using a different font, Comic Sans, for example? Yes, but I need a small one to fit all the information on. What about adding bullet points? <laughs> they could be little lines. People not liking lines is part of the problem, though. Good point. What if the text was centered instead of left justified? Somehow that's I don't solid. think that's going to make a lot of difference. Yeah. I'm not sure there's what There's no lime emoji. It's basically a sales and marketing problem. Wait, there's no Lemons lime emoji? In either no. of those oh, things. I don't believe it. Uh, I see that's what you mean. Why you gotta stick with lemons. Hang on to the flyer. Maybe sure. I can find a sales and marketing expert to look at it. Okay. Rough. Rough. What about Stan? Is Stan a sales and marketing you expert? Right. I feel like I feel like he might be. Can you spare any limes? You can take a few. Well, like I said, I'm having trouble giving them away. <laughs> Strikers is a stream is sponsored by Big Lemon. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Go, 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 go. I love, like, being able to click more, and then go faster, and then I just like screaming, go, 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 go. Halt, oh, yeah. ship. Oh, yeah. This is a scurvy Halt, ship. point. The law requires that you're totally. carrying limes before I allow you to proceed north. Here, look, I have limes. Oh, See? my God, that's such a good gag. To it has the, north, the, the blue and red flag going up yeah, and down. Yeah, right? Form. Name? Guybrush Threepwood. Guybrush Threepwood. Fill this out and be completely honest. Oh fuck, yes. Um Oh my god, I love this so much. Are you ever remember? <laughs> Did you answer question two? Yes, we answered question two. Okay. Or are, are, are you now have you ever been a member of the pirate party? No. Check question four. Not... No, we did. We checked. Oh no! Yes, right. We yeah. checked four and not six. Perfect. Wait, are we a pirate? I thought we were a pirate. Uh, are are we? I think we are. I think we self-identify as pirate. All right. Are you carrying a large live scout? No. Are you carrying more than ten or less than three bananas? Yes, we have no bananas. Yes, we have no bananas. No bananas, yeah. Did um, I check seven? Yes. Did I not check seven? Did you seven? not check seven? No. no. Hell yeah, 12. You checked nine. But we didn't check nine. Yeah, if you, yeah, if you checked nine, which we did not. So it doesn't matter. Yep. Have you not been to Bermuda during the winter? <laughs> this is so fucking obnoxious. Wait, okay. So we have, have been, been to Bermuda during the winter, but we haven't. Well, yeah, like, so if I said, hey, wait, first of all, have we been to Bermuda in the winter? I don't no, think we have. the answer to that is no. So, so have I not been? Perform yes. a not an, a not operation yeah. on that, no. And, and a woodchuck chuck wood? Yes. Can it? I thought it couldn't. <laughs> oh, how much wood could a woodchuck chuck woodchuck could chuck wood? But it can't. It right? can't chuck wood. I it don't think it can chuck wood. It can't chuck wood. Have you have you never worn a disguise or used a pseudonym before? We have used a disguise and used a pseudonym. Is the answer to thirteen and nine a lie? Um, no. 13 and 9? 13 and 9 are both true. Oh, well, here's 13. Here's 9. Right. So, tell me what to do. Do I check I this? think that's blank. No, don't check it. Are you not Because the, answer, the answers to 13 and 9 are both true. 
They're not checked, but they're true. They're truly not checked. They're correctly unchecked. Are you not carrying limes? We are carrying limes, so don't check that one. If you check question one, verify. What's 29? Check this. Check. <laughs> okay, sweet. Okay, are you a power uh, one? I don't think you need to check that, though, do you? Because it's not asking a question. Where? It's just saying verify. So I would leave 19 blank. Nice. If you ever destroyed a priceless artifact and got away with it, absolutely. That sounds right. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Uh, I'm not carrying a trivia of cards. Okay, 27 and 28, Wait. I think... I've answered no, you, trivia we, cards. We, we, we are carrying... Yeah, 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 yeah. We're, carrying, we're carrying the answered ones. I think that we are carrying trivia cards. I 27 and 28 are... Oh, Wait, sorry. I can verify I've answered question 11 incorrectly. I should not check this because I cannot verify it. What's question 11? Well, like, it doesn't matter, right? Because if I answered question 11 incorrectly, I should go back and check it correctly. No matter what. Oh, Sean, wait, can I blow your mind? Yeah. I can verify doesn't mean it is correct. I can verify it just means I have the capability of verifying. Oh. What the fuck? <laughs> I know, okay, I know what you mean in terms of, like, symbolic logic. I right? don't know if that's what this thing means. I know, but, I mean, it's bureaucracy. Because, like, I can verify if I have answered que question... 11 incorrectly discusses the capability i can verify i have answered question 11 incorrectly that's the, the, i feel like that, that's the my my catch what is question 11 just to, so that so that i know what question 11 is did you not check seven did you check question four and not question six are you now or have ever been a member of the pirate party i and then no no, no. oh yeah did you answer question two? Yes. I think I can verify. All right. Uh, that 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 I uh, I can verify. Yeah. I think. Oh, yeah. This is a fucking jerk. What the fuck, man? Twenty. Here's the thing. Twenty-seven and twenty-eight were referenced in a previous question. I think it told us maybe not to check them, not to answer them. I will not answer twenty-seven or twenty-eight. That sounds good. Uh, check if you didn't check question 25. Okay. Don't check this if you didn't check. We did check question 29, so, so we do check. Do it. check that. Uh, I'm not going to double check. I'm just going to sign. I feel good about it. Sign that fucker, yeah. All right. Let's see how you've done. Well, we have a problem right off the start. We don't allow pirates on the- God damn it! <laughs> I'm going to have to request that you leave these waters immediately. Does it have to come the right pirate? No. Back so soon, to proceed north, you'll have to fill out a customs declaration form. Name? Guybrush Threepwood. Fill this out and be completely honest. All right, are you a pirate? No, you don't play that. Right. No. No, I think R. No, yeah, no, don't do R. If you checked nine. So we leave this blank. I think blank, yeah. Have you been reading the winner? No. So we not been? Right. Yes. No. You were worn disguise you assumed before. Oh, I think I think I actually checked this as yes, right? Because I'm not a pirate. Oh man, I don't know. I'm I'm doing this. All right, yeah, 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 yeah. Play it the way you want to play it. I'm, I'm uncertain, like, how to treat that instruction not to lie because 
we're all, we are lying. So like, how much do we lie, and how much does it matter? Mm. So I'm down. All right, go for so, it. Are you not carrying? Li- uh, yeah, because like, if you read this as someone who really wants to keep out pirates, this actually makes more logical sense. Right? Okay. Why? Wait, why? Well, because, like, like, read this as someone who's trying to keep out pirates. Are you a pirate? Right. Have no. you ever been a member of the pirate party? Yeah, like, like, have you ever worn disguise? I see. Have you never done this? Like, hey, have you never done it? Good. They've, they've said they've never done it, you know? Right, 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 right. All right. Is the answer 13 and 9 a lie? And 13 is like, 9 is like, are you carrying large no. livestock? Are you sure you're not a pirate? You know, that sort of thing. Right. If you check question one, verify if you check question 29. Uh, well, but we didn't check question one. I know, but I'm checking oh, this. Oh, but we have to check it anyway. Yeah. It doesn't matter. Okay, cool. No, I've never destroyed a priceless artifact and gotten away with it. Never. Mm-mm. Of course not. Yeah. Yeah. No. No, I don't know why there's a question mark there. Yeah. Uh... So we don't check this. I'm not carrying any trivia cards. I am carrying trivia cards. Right. Cool. Check the. Yeah. Check, check, wait, 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 check, uh, check 32. Right. Let's see oh, shit. Hmm. Did I miss Good that? Answer. Interesting yeah. Interesting you would check that one. Good penmanship. Okay. This looks in order. I'm a goat. Doesn't Do matter. Good enough. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Ah, uh, yes. Oh, I love Gets. paperwork. <laughs> Get <Get's laughs> Roblox's. <laughs> All hail the bureaucracy. Yes. I would 100% play a game that was based entirely around that mechanic. Mm. Oh my god. It's, I would, it's a quite frankly, island. I would make a game that was entirely based around that mechanic. <laughs> Alright. Anyone see any trivia cards? The bucket filled to the brim with rotten fish bones. Heck yeah. Oh, trivia card. I see ya. Trivia card! It's in the trap. It's Ooh, a, that was... far away from this. <laughs> the wind must have blown out the fire. It's a very regal looking ice sculpture. Where is the crest of Bermuda? Let's check. Where where do we think the crest Is it that bird on the like right above the king? I uh, I think that there'll be a crest of Bermuda. You think there will be a, a more obvious crest? Quest for the crest. Where a crest quest? All right. Well, these are the only three locations here, so I'm just going to go back to the town center. Because there is a bird up on that roof, right? Like you see the bird. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's a bird there, and I'm okay. going to go into the town hall because I bet locked. there's a crest. Maybe I'll come back later. Okay. Very good. Very good. Problem solving. We're solving problems. Feeling good. It says. Courthouse of Bermuda. Oh, there looks like there's a bird on that little crest, right? Yeah. It's, it's kind of bat-like, but it's very small. Snow owl, monkey, eagle, parrot. I mean, probably not a monkey, right? Looks like an eagle. I'm going to enter the courthouse and see if we can get a better look at a crest somewhere. Oh, damn. Dude, this, this is like the courthouse scene in fucking Chrono Trigger. Order! Order in the court! I am going to cite you for contempt of court for not asking permission to approach the bench. I humbly apologize. May I approach the bench, Your Honor? You may approach the bench. Court is now in session. Judge Hell yeah. presiding. Excellent. How do you plead? Oh, shit. 
there must be some mistake here. Order! Order in the <laughs> Look at his little hammer! Not the gallery, or there will be arrests. That is very small. That is... That is a wee little hand. Alright. I've... Uh, yeah. What did your honor do wrong to get this appointment? Yeah. Never beat a Supreme Court oh, justice man. in cribbage. <laughs> <laughs> your honor, do you have to buy your own robes? Or are they court appointed? Order! Order in the court! <laughs> if I don't get order, I am going to clear the court! Did I mention I am searching for the secret of Monkey Island? Until it becomes a legal matter before the court, it is of no interest to me. Although I'll be back I in a minute. A Don't beat the game without me. Where the it's done. Was we'll try. You know I'm tired. Sell computer games. I believe that will settle out of court for a substantial sum. Your Honor, are you wearing pants under that robe? Please remember that you're under oath. Order, order in the court. <laughs> <If> I... <laughs> that is all, Your Honor. Court is adjourned. <laughs> Oh, you man. You may approach guilty. Do you plead guilty? That's, like, so good. Oh. The uh, lookout, right? Doesn't the lookout reference loom? I thought it was somebody in the bar, wasn't it? I, my guess would be Gob. Oh, yeah, there's that guy who's just, like, the hip new Who's guy. got, like, the button. He's got the ask me about yeah, loom button. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck yeah. Absolutely killing the game. Wait, did we not answer the other one? We we haven't answered the other one. Is it on a different page? Well, you can only have one at a time. I think it's an eagle. Oh, okay, I fucking suck. Good job. <laughs> All right. uh, why can we look at the yeah? Thirsty. Can we light something on fire? Oh, okay. it's like hell yeah, dude. That is about what I am talking. I gotta stop saying about what I am talking. I don't even like saying it, but I've like habitized saying it for so many fucking years, man. Oh no. Uh, no. Is there anything special about this stump? No. Why? Well, it was tagged, <laughs> so I thought. You know, maybe there would be a great gag about a secret opening <laughs> to a system of tunnels or something like that. Please, don't joke about tunnels next to the prison, sir. No, why? I like this guy. Hi. Any chance I could get inside the quarry? Not many try to get in here. Just out. What's the purpose of your visit? I was hoping for a tour. We don't give tours here. Look. The only people allowed inside are the prisoners. And also, I suppose, people visiting the prisoners. But <laughs> no one ever does that. What's that thing? Uh, nothing. What's that thing? Uh, nothing. I want it so bad. I'd I like mean, it's so prison, important. We do have a nothing has ever policy, been more important to me. Strict. Who I am now a cat. I really want to smack that. Stan? Is Stan here? Stan. We do have a Stan. I'm a little surprised he yeah, doesn't. Yeah, Stan, visited. Stan, man. Can you prove you know him? I can describe him. Loud jacket. Never stops moving his arms. Or his <laughs> That does sound like him. But I'm supposed to see some actual physical evidence. I got that. Just do we? something okay. that shows you two. That way, I can tell my fa. Uh, my boss. That I did my job. Yeah, we got this thing right here. Uh, it's this little, it's that little card that says. Um, wait. Oh shit! No, I guess we fucking don't. I don't. I don't remember that. We had a card or something. <laughs> we have a fucking. Yeah. <laughs> So we probably have to go back to the island to get something that stands. Probably yeah, from the cell. right, because he won't be in the cell anymore. Nice view. Okay. I mean, this is some some like Looney Tunes ass music. 
This is great. Yeah, this is my every Mancini action. Roaring fire, melting ice, very hoogly. <laughs> Whoa. Welcome, I don't loyal know subject. that word. Oh, look, there's a gold. You can see the golden key in the crown. Oh, I didn't see it. Okay. It's slowly filling up with castle. <laughs> <laughs> this entire castle is made of ice. Thank goodness there's a fire. Ready to be freezing. Ah. This reminds me of These that matches are specially bad formulated for freezing Brosnan, temperatures. Disclaimer: uh, Will not light underwater. James Bond movie. Wait, sorry. What'd you say? Pierce. One of the Pierce Brosnan James Bond movies was like took took place in Alaska or yeah yeah somewhere in a in an ice hotel that they blew up with a satellite. Is that? And he he had an invisible car. Is that the world's not enough or tomorrow never dies? It's not tomorrow never dies because that was about newspapers. It might be the world is not enough. The world is not enough is the family crest for uh, like the family motto for James Bond. And I don't know how that ties into the plot of any of the movies. <laughs> so I can never remember which one that is. What's the purple At the book? end of the plank. My only copy. Die another day is what chat is saying. Yeah. Hi. All right. Well, I didn't quite catch that. Urgh. I see. Urgh. Urgh. Bermuda seems like a friendly place. Yeah, I feel you. <laughs> That's yeah. pretty good. Grunt. 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 What does erg grunt erg mean? Grunt. Oh, so is it? Grunt. Grunt. Do I just do the same thing that she says? Erg. Grunt. Oh, that's smart. That's worth doing. Erg. I think the top one is the closest, but these are that's different what I did options last time. now. Sure. I don't, I don't know if this is actually productive. <laughs> yeah, is this is this is this the, the poetry of this? <laughs> this, is, this is pretty. I'm, I'm, dude, I, I gotta I gotta not reject this frog again. <laughs> Oh, I just walk up to her. You just walk up. Oh, most oh there's a frozen parrot. Ruler person. Oh, I see. <laughs> no need to be so formal. This is Bermuda, your guy brush three point, aren't you? I'm Odina the Ninth. Oh, the Ninth. I know your wife. The Ninth. Elaine? You sound uncertain. How many wives have you got? <laughs> just the one I'm aware of. What brings you north of the 19th parallel, Guybrush? Oh, Is man. that one of the golden keys on your head? Welded to my crown. That's correct. The crown of keys is a ceremonial artifact worn by the reigning queen of Bermuda. It was originally fashioned from the house keys of the citizens as a gesture of trust. And or submission? My predecessor as queen is the one who added the golden key. I think it gives a certain pizzazz. <laughs> Naturally, you'll want to have that cleaned once in a while. <laughs> it stays perfectly clean as long as I don't let greasy pirates put their paws all over it. You may touch the crown if and when you become queen, and not before. All right, it's time to become, become queen. queen. Hell yeah, become queen. All right. Hypothetically, how exactly would a person become queen of Bermuda? You have to earn it, win it, wrest it from the iron grip of the previous queen. Most people can't manage that, of course. 
But by the traditions of Bermuda, all are welcome to try. To become queen, you must show your qualifications by defeating all right, the great. current List queen three. in three contests. The contests test your heartiness, your seriousness, and your intelligence. All right. I have, I have some of those things. I have some of those things. We'll see. Then no cheating. We'll see. <laughs> All right. That's so good. I challenge you to the contest of heartiness. Come with me. We've got to go downtown. God, I hope it's like a speed-based puzzle. There are three of them here in the building. One for each contest. When you want to formally issue a challenge, you ring the triangle. Fish of the day. Are we going to have to eat fish? Another challenge. All right, we got to get that guy in on it. Ladies and gentlemen, although your appetite for this nauseating affair never ceases people. to amaze Aww, me, it is cutie. my solemn duty to adjudicate this, the contest of heartiness. <laughs> As you are all thoroughly aware, the objective is to successfully and permanently consume more raw fish than your opponent. Today's challenge fish is hackfish. Yep, 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 yep. Wait a moment. Oh, you just want to the sit there. Bucket of plenty contains no plenty. There are no fish here whatsoever, and the contest cannot be held without fish. Everyone, go home. All right. Well, hey, we got into a new location. I have a new little companion. Yeah, that's a good one. All right, I'm done. Yeah. All right, let me let me hit the tab button. Trivia card, yeah, hell yeah. Hell yeah, trivia. Many ship masks can be seen in the street with a sleeping pirate. <laughs> what sleeping pirate? Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> it's nicely dried, pre-cut, and ready to go. Ah. Or Moodian. Okay. I want to see something. Okay, so Mumble leaves consistently. Yes, Mumble is oh, the exit. Shit. It's the soon to be former queen. I mean, study I algebra. Guess this is algebra? I actually have no idea. Hey. What up? I can feel all the what water up? up the chimney. Hey. Ow, Jesus, Jesus. It's an empty bucket. Cat, what are you doing, cat? She's going to town with her little claws in my leg. Those Close little down. claws. All right, so yeah, I'm I'm like right here. Hi. Do you wanna do you wanna okay. ring the triangle and see what that challenge is? Yeah, and sorry. or what we need to do to be able to do it? Got distracted when my little cat just extended her paw up to my I eyes. I know, man. It's a very mm. distracting little cat. Oh, a challenge. <laughs> Welcome, Your Majesty and Mr. Threepwood to the contest of intelligence. In front of each of you is an advanced algebra problem. You are to solve it as completely as you can, and remember to show your work. No peeking, no copying, no swapping papers, and no cheating whatsoever. I will return in 20 seconds to grade your papers. Your time starts now. I don't have the slightest idea how to solve an algebra problem. No copying. No funny business, Buster. You're gonna have to distract her, I guess? Throw chicken feet at her. <laughs> I feel like we're gonna want to light a fire in the fireplace, but I don't know what that's gonna accomplish. Hmm. Hmm. 
No surprises here. Queen Odina <laughs> has delivered a clear and correct answer with a step-by-step -step proof. Mr. Threepur has drawn a series of mustaches on the polynomial. Queen Odina <laughs> is the winner. Better luck next time. All right, there's the hardiness room. What's the back room? Oh, it's carved out of wood. Arm wrestling. It's very lifelike. Ladies and gentlemen, for your viewing pleasure, we present for only the eleventh time this week the contest of seriousness. Yep, 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 and on this side, Papa, the challenger, yep, yep. Guybrush Threepwood, currently unemployed and of no fixed address. If you all come to order, the contest will begin. The first <laughs> contestant such a good is it the is loser. Brilliant. Have you heard the one about the guy who put an ice cube on a scurvy dog? He said it was chilly. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I'm gonna be bad at this. I already, I already lost. The ship. I am not qualified to be oh, Queen of Bermuda. Of Wait, let me... Uh, wh where's the terrible... Oh. Uh, the, no, what about the, uh, the flyer about limes? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, wait. Yeah, use it. Yeah. I need a real marketing no. expert. Someone who could sell foot powder to fish. Oh, because this poem was so bad. I, it was I, so uh, bad. Hi, I'm working due east of Parrot Rock. I think you're going to have to click the waterfall on today. Is what I think. Oh, nice. What's the difference between a swabby and a mop? What's the difference between a swabby and a mop? Heard it. You might as well oh, give no. up. I have heard every joke there is in this world. Contestants, the time limit has been reached. <laughs> as neither of you has laughed, the contest is a draw. See ya. All right, all right, sweetie pie. I know you love it so much. My leg is losing a lot of blood. <laughs> Blood layer. Yeah, I'm losing blood in my leg. My leg. A little bit of blood in my leg. <laughs> leg blood is like a really good name for like a general NPC <laughs> in a grimy town. <laughs> it's true. All right, so where's the fire? Nice. It's a remarkably accurate representation of Queen Odina the Ninth of Bermuda. All right, let me just light some torches. It's way too high to reach. Damn. Oh. So here's some fish. A bucket filled yeah. to the brim with rotten fish bones. All right, let me let me talk to the judge. May I approach the bench, Your Honor? Oh. You may approach the bench. <laughs> Court is now in Your Honor, what is the legal status of the royal challenges? <laughs> the traditional Bermudian contests of hardiness, seriousness, and intelligence have been ruled to be fully constitutional. Does the plaintiff need more information? All right, let's go down one at a time. Well, yeah. I seek to inquire to accept about the asking contest for a friend. of hardiness. Statute 45, Section 2, Subsection A states... The contest of hardiness is an eating contest. You must eat more fish than the queen, or she less than you. So we need to like tape her mouth shut so she can't eat, and then eat one. Yeah. Can, can we make That's what her? We need to do. Can we make her eat the rotten fish and then throw up? Oh yeah. So she's she eating negative eaten fish. Yeah. yeah. I seek to inquire about the contest of seriousness. You need to destroy your mouth. The contest of seriousness <laughs> is what we call a stone face contest. Whoever laughs first is the loser. Upon appeal to a higher court, the telling of jokes was ruled to be allowed. Further appeal to the Supreme Court found the actual encouragement of jokes to be fair. 
I seek to inquire. Statute, the contest of intelligence is an advanced algebra quiz. Said quiz shall be timed and binding. Upon appeal, it was ruled that the algebra questions can include questions involving polynomials, but not integration of unknown terms. Do you know advanced algebra? I'm pretty sure I got an A. I'm also pretty sure I cheated. Order, <laughs> order in the- There is no- like, ah! <laughs> So perhaps we make her look like she's cheating? Thank you. Oh, oh interesting. Oh, I mean, this is great. This is just like QA for the game in action. So, Lee, if you want to just like change any of the game up based upon our brilliance, like you let me know. Yeah. I mean, the idiot who placed a torch next to an ice sculpture. <laughs> Such a good gag. All right, so. A bucket filled to the brim with. So here's here's what I want to do. I want to yep. go back here and I want to get some. Okay, I want to go to LeChuck's ship and I want to see if I can. Uh, hello? Anyone up there patrolling the deck? Ready to kick me into the sea? Sounds like the coast is clear. I hope. Unless it's a trap. You are a disgrace to the pirating profession. I'm more focused on the staying alive. I want to get the joke right book Thanks. from this. Mm. So far, so good. Do I have that eye patch? I guess not. So, um, obviously I'm actually Guybrush Threepwood. Pleased to meet you. Again. I assume that's your real skin this time? Yeah. Sorry for tricking you with the other two. Two? Uh, one. Math's not my best subject. <laughs> By the way, don't worry about it. You're LeChuck's rival, not mine. I've got better things to worry about. Also, I enjoyed the book you brought me. Oh. Are you finished with the joke book yet? Emotionally, yes. It's not that long, and I've read it 16 times already. Can I have the joke book back? Then Gosh. what am I supposed to read? You said you were finished. You've read it 16 times. It's boring reading it over and over, but it's better than nothing. All right, well, so there's the purple book, so we got to get the purple book. Where is everybody? Flame What's the purple book? Crow's nest. Odds are he's sleeping. Iron Rose said she was running an errand. The rest went with LeChuck on that other ship. Would that be Captain Madison's ship? I think that's right. Interesting. Can can we give him the tract about scurvy and get the joke book and then swap back at some point? Yeah. Remind me why Flambe still has a job. He doesn't do anything. Yay, Flambe! He's handy to have around when we have to fix things below the waterline at night. Hang in there, Bob. Still not funny. <laughs> All right, so the... I'm sure I can find someone better qualified. All right, all right, all right. All right. Hey, Bob, I've got a great oh, book for you. Oh, LeChuck's diary. It's LeChuck's personal diary. Yikes. I wouldn't want to be caught with that. And you shouldn't either. Damn. Hey, Bob, I've got a great book for you. It's Gullet's Poetry. Unpublished. You can There's get some a sneak reason peek. that we couldn't there read it. There is nothing about Gullet that I want a sneak peek of. What kind of books do you like? At this point, I'd have to say, long ones. I go for pure, unadulterated, massive length. The trouble with books is that they end. All right, all right, all right. Where, where can we get, like, an endless book? I think it's out of juice. Oh, it's the disguise <laughs> poem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, <laughs> der da burr. Der da burr. Der da burr. Der da burr. I wouldn't want to wake up. <laughs> All right. That uh, sound of him snoring is like really right in my left ear there. Yeah, no, I mean, it was, it was <laughs> relatively <close>. intense. <laughs> <laughs> Let me take stuff. If I'm wrong about what that is, taking it would be... Oh, I don't know why I keep doing the same things and they don't work, but there's this like... Compulsion in me. Oh, it's an empty box. An empty demon pepper box. Looks like Putra replenished her supplies. Yeah. Oh, shit. This is the shit that's like fire. Oh, we can put this on her stuff. This is mm. Putra's demon pepper. I mean, we have to get some stuff first. 
tasting it is not a good idea. Oh shit, I did something of non-zero value. I'm like so fucking surprised. I'm like so blown away. That's so tight. Oh my god, let's let's I just want to hear one more. Ooh. I'll keep my distance. Mothers are more, more important. <laughs> there it is. Is the taste of after chicken the same as the Very good. Alright. Alright, so now we're gonna get the fuck out of here. Oh shit, there was a trivia note right fucking there! <sighs> to an adrift ship. Alright, I, I gotta do for completion's Ahoy. sake. Ahoy! 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 <laughs> <laughs> Permission to come aboard. <laughs> Afraid we can't let you do that. Permission to come aboard, sir. This isn't a protocol issue. Although we do enjoy a good protocol. <laughs> Are you going to let me talk? Apparently, that's what you enjoy doing. There's been a deadly scurvy outbreak on the ship. We're under strict quarantine, so we don't infect others with this deadly pathogen. Uh... Okay. Have a look at this flyer on limes. Uh, They're not going to read it. Acid deficiency, collagen synthesis, mucous membranes. Hey, that is a bunch of science nonsense. We won't have any of that around here. It's all a trick to track our plunder. As if you have any plunder. A trick to track our plunder. Oh my god, because the vaccines insert microchips into your blood. Into your leg blood. Oh my leg god. Blood. I like don't blood. think scurvy is contagious. You don't know that. My uncle's best friend's wife's dog walker says it is. It's a scientific fact. Oh, don't try to snow us with your science <laughs> Oh my god. If scurvy <laughs> wasn't contagious, then only one person would have it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Where'd you get that cool flag with all the holes? We found it floating in the ocean. It's one of Bella <laughs> Fisher's flags. She probably lost it when her ship went down. We're afraid to take it down and offend the scurvy gods. <sighs> there is no such thing as the scurvy gods. My God, it's anti scurvy? Limers. It's great. Yeah, I love the general <laughs> ideas. Yeah. Can I have <laughs> Did you not hear me? Scurvy. Well, <laughs> that actor is so good. Yeah, that Don't is you know not hear me? You should try limes. Where did you hear that? Is that more of your science mumbo jumbo? You need to leave before. Mumbo jumbo? You don't know that. Pedal your son. Bye. Don't let the skirt scurvy butt. <laughs> I'm sensing a generally negative attitude directed at this clever mashup really gets the point across. Okay, oh, I want to. Their rules. I want to go to Melee Island and try to get in to see Stan, so that we can hit give him the the yeah, scurvy the, flyer. There's a lot of things that we need to do. So first, we need to go to the jail where Stan hey, was. Guy Brush. Guy Brush. Otis, Otis, Otis. What are we gonna do with you? I didn't do anything this time. I was framed. Okay, so we're gonna get some information from here. Uh, we actually have a bunch of tasks to do here. Yeah, we do. Where's Stan? Did they let him go? No, Stan got sentenced to hard time. Did you know he was representing himself? I've heard that's unwise. They took him to the ice quarry on... What did you do to get arrested this time? Nothing! I was just standing there minding my own business, applying for earthquake relief. Did you know you're only allowed to do that once? There is no justice. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so. The lamp broke. It's been reduced to oh, rubble. Read the important it says information. Jail rules. I like this. One, no escaping. Two, no earthquakes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so good. Okay, so what we need Wait, to do. Wait, was Stan in the other cell? Can we get into the other cell? Uh, no, it's 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 fully collapsed. Because Stan oh. was in there. Stan is inside doing hard time on the island, so we need something. No, 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 I get that. I, I just didn't know if there was something in his cell that we could use. But I guess not. Oh, All of his brain knowledge. I just I just remembered something. So first we need to go to I don't know how closer than ever. Get me the I'm fuck out of here. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, in so, his Yeah, he has his toothbrush oh. in his shack. 
How the fuck do I get to the right. map? Could I be any slower getting to the map? Jesus. Stan's right, building right, right. collapsed. This place looks like an earthquake hit it. There's a torn picture in here. This half shows Stan himself. Okay, we're, so we're gonna put together different combinations of pictures. We're gonna have to find the other half of this picture that shows us on the right hand side and then put that with the picture of Stan nice. to make it look like we're in the same picture. Great. It's sad to see the shipyard like this. So we now have evidence that we Oh shit. No, we have we have this toothbrush. It's old and the bristles are frayed, but it does resemble a toothbrush. Okay, so there's there's a lot of stuff going on right now. There is so much fucking shit. So we need so to go to watch. There's so much stuff. We need to find an image of ourselves. Hey. You do. That's true. All right. Oh my the god. The endless tale of the voyage that would not book. end? One book at a time. I only trust you so far. Shit. So what book? The cookbook. Oh fuck. Fuck, I can't believe I've done this. Jesus. We're, we gotta get the cookbook back? <sighs> uh, how about that earthquake? I was a little worried about the mansion being built on a precarious cliff and all. The mansion's fine. And so am I. Thanks for asking. Have you seen the line of people outside? Right. Those are citizens who were affected by the quake. Elaine was here to help me set up a program. But there isn't any money in the coffers to support the relief effort. Oh my I'm basically God. handing out IOUs. Hey, you're just like FTX. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Oh, I love this cat. Okay, hold on. Uh oh. Good cat. Good cat. Don't don't go that way. Do not. All right. I like that I've been playing a lot of card and adventure games. So. Can I get in on some of that sweet, sweet disaster relief? That way I can I just hold her and prevent her from going no on money. the keyboard. I'm handing out IOUs. I'll take what I can get. Fine. I have to list a purpose, so what's it for? Um, a keel overhaul? Huge houses crack on Wall <laughs> Street. There's a huge <gasps> keel overhaul. Oh my god. Houses. That's really good. I say public parkour course. But I guess you're right. This is just a promise from the town to back your relief project at a later date. Don't get too excited. All right, so what did I get? It's an IOU for funds for repairing the crack on Low Street. Okay, so I don't know what that does. Oh shit, I clicked outside the window. Can't you do that. crack funds. We need to go back here, and then we need to go get the cookbook. From the docks near the ship. Can we can we try to learn the difference between high street, high street and low street while we're here? Yeah. Are you done with the cookbook? I'd like it back. No, you can't take it. With my bar gone and no hope to repair it, this is. <laughs> All right, so we need an IOU. What are you talking about? Oh, okay, that's good. That's smart. <laughs> what are you? So low street, ah, so high street is the one. The first thing that we see is low street because we are at the docks and we go to the lower right. street and then we go to a higher street and then we go to the, the governor's mansion. So the crack is on low street. The other, oh, the, no, the but that's what I thought. The, the first one we see is the one with the jail. And then the second one we see is the one with the voodoo shop. Isn't that High Street? Isn't that where Wally is? That, that's the it's the other way around. It's the other way around. It's one. Okay. If you want, I can revise the IOU. I get. Yes, please. Okay. Uh, rebuild local businesses. I want to rebuild local businesses. I'm sure you'll have public support on that one. All right. What, what was the term go. that um, I, keen on bluntness? <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. So, so this yeah. goes to High Street. So now okay, we are in. Go to High Street. So this is High Street. Oh. And then this is Low Street. Damn. Okay. Yeah, I had that backward. 
Absolutely, I did too, and I even clicked the button. What would you say if I told you the governor authorized funds for the rebuilding of the scum bar at an unspecified future date? She did? That's fantastic. Mm -mm. Oh, have a sunken area mm -mm. that catches frog mm -mm. spills for recycling and uh, medical treatment. <laughs> catches frog spills, spills for oh, recycling. <laughs> Oh, terrible. Okay, if I terrible. take this cookbook back now? Sure. Go, 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 go. Left to right, right to zoom, left. Zoom, 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 zoom. Right to left again. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, did I, tell, did I tell you too that I learned that I haven't been standing up straight for like years? Really? Well, cause like, I, I, okay. So it, this is really, really weird. Cause I was having like lower back pains every sure. time I was doing yoga and I like never have lower back problems. Um, so like I couldn't figure out what the heck was going on. So I want you to imagine someone who is s giving someone instructions on how to stand up straight. It's okay. the usual stuff of like, okay, well, like pull your shoulders back, you know, like don't hunch your head forward, you know, like don't round mm -hmm. your lower back, all that sort of stuff. And imagine you said those things to someone that was already standing up straight. Right. Yeah. That's basically what I have been doing is I would sit kind of comfortably and then I'd be like, oh, it's time to sit up straight. So I would like sit up or stand up straight. But what I was actually doing mm -hmm. was instead of straightening my back, I was sort of curving it backwards a bit. Like my mm. hips, my hips were in front of my ankles and in front of my shoulders. So basically, I mean, I, I I looked like the wood part of a bowstring, mm -hmm. right? Like oh. I had a little curve thing. So so most of the time, it's just not that extreme. So I just feel nothing, and I sit in like this chair that forces you to be ergonomic. So I always yeah. feel great the longer I sit in this chair. But when you're trying to do yoga moves, and you're like bending your back back a lot. Like all, my, like all of the weight of my body was on my lower back. <laughs> right, right. It was the weirdest thing in the entire universe. When I was like, when, when she was like, I went to the instructor after class. I was like, okay, wait, get like, can you help me like position my body correctly? And she was like, okay, straighten your back. And I kind of did this. And she's like, no, no, you're curving it backwards. Like lean forwards. And I leaned forward in what I thought was a hunch. She's like, there, your back straight. And so the oh, weirdest no. thing is that I have perceived this is me hunting yeah, right. forward, but this is actually me sitting up straight. Straight, totally. Like, I, like literally right now, if you said, Sean, what do you look like from the side? I would draw like the top half of a question mark. <laughs> and if I like look in the mirror, that's incorrect. I mean, I tend to like, especially if I'm reading, I like extend my neck forward like this, which right. is like different than the spine being. So man, this is some fucking crazy shit, man. That's wild. That, I mean, it's like straight fucked up, dude. Thank you. Thanks for returning my book. Maybe you have learned to be responsible. Can I borrow this book? Fine. Thanks. Oh, it's the endless book that will never end. So let's see, what, what do we need to do? We have like a daisy chain of shit. We need to find a photo of ourselves somewhere. Yeah, we do need to find that. And here's the key maker, so I need to use the lens to find the key from the guy who has the... I need to go to this guy and get his key code here. Hold it! Are you sure you weren't falling oh, over right. sale? right! Is that a sale? Oh. I forgot that's how keys <laughs> oh, wait, work. It's a sea. Nothing to see but a lot of corrosion. Leave that Damn alone! It. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. I feel like we're definitely going to need his picture, but I don't know what for. We could go to Elaine and ask her what happened to the other half of the photo that she had. Nice. All right, to Scurvy Island. Elaine, I'm coming, darling. I love how bouncy everybody is. Hi. Hi. <laughs> do, 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 do. Oh, oh, almost walked. Walk. Oh. Oh, I, I that it's mechanic is really cool. Us. Yeah, Elaine. What? What? How come the picture of us on your desk was torn in half? Ah, uh, yes. Sorry, you saw that. 
There was an incident with a seagull. It flew away with you into the lime groves. I looked, but I couldn't find you. I see. You said a seagull carried away my half of the picture of us? It flew into the lime groves. All right. Love you. Hmm. You too. Oh my god, I love having an in-game character tell me that they love me. Yeah, you have a digital it's very wife sweet. now. Yeah. Where did I find the mint groves? The bird Whoa. has a torn picture in its nest. Is that a picture of me? Ah, that bird needs an attitude adjustment. Throw a lime at it. Oh, I'm gonna give it ghost chicken feed. <gasps> it's ghost chicken ghost feed? Chicken. It's a seagull. God Fuck. damn it. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the shit? All right, I'm going back to a lane. Attitude adjustment. Uh, back really? Lane. Have we exhausted all of the options there? I mean, I don't even know what the Hi. options were. Hi. You said a sea. It flew in. All right. Did Love I you. throw you limes too. at it? Really? You think that's... Try to set it on fire. All right. Okay. You know, that that's that's just so barbaric. I would never have assumed. It's not an adventure game unless you completely obliterate a bird nest. Crackers? It's not a parrot. It's a seagull. God damn it. <laughs> no way. I don't want to lose my hand. So what if I combine this with the... Okay. Mm, spicy spices? Spicer spice? I don't think so. I might need to eat these in an emergency. Um... Fuck. Oh, fuck. Yeah, check, check some gold at it. X, Y, Z, Z, Y. Dang. Pay it off. Okay, I, I literally have no idea how to even make Okay, all right. Okay. Now you have done, you have oh, done more things. Plan. I am it's satisfied like with the things game. that you've done. I am satiated in my curiosity. Hmm. <laughs> Twisting path. We have a lantern that's lit now. Hashtag lit. Lit life. This is the most lit that this canyon cave thing has ever been. Cavian. 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 It says, warning, you are about to enter a maze of twisting paths <laughs> mostly very similar. It says, warning, you are about. All right, where's X, Y, Z, Z, Y? Is the twassages. X Y Z Z Y was the the magic word. Yeah. The, it was that. Uh, did that let you teleport? What did that do? Oh. Hear him screaming this way. From this is the original Zork, right? Or is it? Uh, yeah. Yeah. It's not Colossal is Cave. This I think it's the original Zork. Z -Z it is from it is from Colossal Cave? Okay. I wanna see where the screaming comes from. Do you think it's a directional? <laughs> no. So if I go this way. Alright. So said... There are there's like graffiti carved on these different yeah. passages. I feel like we recognize this from somewhere. No, no, I recognize these shapes from an escape room that I did with Brit. So this is... Mm. This yeah, this is... game goes really deep, Sean. <laughs> oh, I see. So this is... I think that it's because this is a deterministic thing. So if I, like, went back this way... You can retrace your steps. Yeah, this is all... This is all logical. It's not like giving you random rooms. Looks like someone forgot to pick up their trash. His major voyage quest nearing completion. Reginald's nose tasted spring coming once again upon the sea's breezes. Oh, for land to be ho again. <laughs> 
Okay, what is Taste it? it spring little diagonal eye. I'd like to tell you something. Mm. All the Reginald stuff was written by yours truly. Oh, oh yeah? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Yeah, see, look, there's a little... A little diagonal eye. There. I like this puzzle. No. Those crisp fall blank nights at sea. All right, so we're we're gonna. Okay, spring around. and fall, right? Like it's it's symbols depicting seasons. Oh, but you have to read it out loud because those cause it's, crisp it's fall so good. nights at sea. The ship undulated, wet and rocking, <laughs> and yet in the bunks below decks, no one was knocking. Oh shit! Look outside. I'm so proud. I'm so proud of myself. Oh yeah. Ugh. set free at last. Every ocean sunrise and moonrise reminds me of you. Those dual orbs dancing in the winter sky, he mused, pen in hand. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that is fucking so funny. Okay. <laughs> okay. Their last summer night together was torrid, lurid, and the night was long, but insufficiently so because morning came too soon when he must set sail. Why not? What is going to be the fifth season? Spring <laughs> sprung hard. The blank flowers yawned wide. The bees dove in. Knowing he must sail away, the next season on his major voyage quest, she tried and failed to keep it casual. <laughs> so this is the uh, start area. Lovely. Lovely. Oh, interesting. So I'm fucking lost as shit. The fort to now. All right, so no, never make it out. There we go. We're gonna go this way. Dupe. So I assume that what it's what? doing is that it's generating some random stuff. So this gets generated, and then it's gonna be something that has this symbol. Why do you think that? Because I was going left or right. Assume that this was first. Okay. Right, well, that that's that one right there. And does this next symbol? I'm sure there are plenty. This symbol show up? Fall, winter. Spring, summer, spring again. Okay, so I think we have to order these. Order them chronologically? Yeah. Uh, well, it ends in spring, right? It ends in the two springs. So it would be summer, fall, winter, spring, spring. Um, I think this is the last one. Those crisp fall nights at sea, the ship under the wet and rocking, and yet the bunks below decks, no one was knocking. Because, like, there's Why? no one. Because, like, I'm imagining, um... I'm gonna sail away. Wait. What? Oh god, people are backseating. Ghosty. Alright. Oh no. Alright, everyone, stop backseating. Stop back. No backseating. Okay. Do not try to solve this. Do not try to give us hints. Do not say, ooh, maybe XYZ. Just sit quietly. Sit quietly and cut off your fingers. Do like me. Do like me and don't yeah. give them any clues. Now, give them nothing. Crazy Chat, good it's time at this. To give, it's time to give nothing. Chat. Now, you might be going, what did I do? The answer is, I don't know. I just heard Lee say, oh, uh, back seating. So there yeah. you go. So. Okay, so I read the middle one as penultimate is, is how I'm reading this uh, shot. Right? Which makes me think that 
the the second spring spring sprung hard is the last one and it has kind of a uh, a sense of finality oh although it could also be the first one i guess it could be spring summer fall winter spring no he must say loy the next season on his major voyage quest she tried to right. to keep it casual and then it goes around until his major voyage quest nearing completion. Every ocean sunrise and moonrise reminds me of you. These dual orbs dancing in the winter sky, he mused. Actually, so Okay, here, I see spring. what you're saying. So here's summer. They were together in summer. Yeah. Uh, and he set sail, and then in the fall he was at sea, oh, and then th in the I think, winter. I think it goes like this because it starts off. Yeah. Tried and failed to keep it casual. Then yeah. The last summer night together, the night was long. Yeah. Morning came soon when you must set sail. Those crisp fall nights at sea, yeah. the ship undulated, went rocking, and no one was knocking. Every yeah. ocean sunrise, moon rise reminds me of you. These dual orbs dancing in the winter sky amused. His voyage questing and completion of no state of spring. Oh, for land to be ho again. Yeah, I think you're right. Yeah, so we do cross hatchy, squirky, loopy, eyeball, and ooh, hedron. Oh, ooh, hedron. So I just go. None in of some none direction. of those are here. <laughs> Somehow we got to get back. Yeah. Oh, cross hatchy, hatchy, squicky. What's Wait. quickie? Oh, there's okay, another. Okay, Hatchy. Hatchy. Fuck! <laughs> oh my god. <gasps> All of our delicate work. FYI, I'm gonna have to bounce in like five minutes. But, oh, shit. that doesn't mean that y'all have to rap, but just don't beat the game without me. I don't know that there's a lot of chance of that, Lee. Not unless you uh Wait, wait, maybe it it's secret way. maybe it's Hedron first. Hedron? It's major void quest nearing completion original nose tasted spring coming once again. Oh, coming once again upon the But spring. yeah, that makes me think it's it is last. Cause that's what I was thinking. Spring was coming and then spring sprang hard. I thought that was the sequence, but I no longer think that. I now I think that the middle one is the is a year later. Fucking oh shit, dude! Because I just okay. New quest. Yeah. Can we get out of the cave? No. I mean, I don't. I I don't think you've tried hard enough. Yeah, you're pretty much at a. Um, you just have to delete your save game. If you get lost in this cave, you just have to delete your save game. Um. And uninstall. And on, yeah, that sounds right. Yep. This is uh, we're doing some lose lose style shit here. It's gonna start deleting files off of your hard drive. Yeah, that's right. Holy fucking shit, dude! So the, these are, are the symbols consistently paired. I'm look here. I think the no, the they're not. Symbols are consistent from room to room so for instance this okay is... i think if you go left here i think go left here uh and then so like oh, if i, I go up, up and then if i go left here we end up in the same configuration of shapes so these rooms we can actually like they are consistent we could yeah, map this we out could map this out yeah i i i sort of think that the entrance of the cave is kind of up left well, the or maybe do left the orientation is weird so if you go up this way it sometimes pops yeah. you on the right right I don't I don't like I don't have a that's just sort of a general sense that I've got so it's not so this is eyeball hedron starter guy starter guy yeah I thought this was the starter guy yeah, because, like, n n now we're starting to recognize these rooms again. 
Yeah. All right. This fucking sucks. Okay, so now I'm going to actually pay attention. And Lee, you're just going to be like, damn. You're going to be like that guy. Okay, All right, so you got to make it fast because I got to go eat a sandwich. Yeah. Solve the game real fast. Let's solve this game real fast. I do like this puzzle, by the way. And I did most of the coding of the mazes. Yeah. But that also it's... means that I think I got the award for programmer who had most of their work thrown away. Because <laughs> 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 I would code That's it up fair. and then the, the, the design would change, you know? Yeah. So I'm, I'm trying to go just down and left and see what the repeating pattern is. So, like, let's see when we see this little triangle thing again, if we do. So here was the this one that I actually good. started this my journey on. Content. I wonder if it's like a transformation of these symbols. Yeah, because there's our triangle guy mm -hmm. again. So we just did a little loop. Delicious. So like this eye turn sideways. What about that thing? I know, but I don't think they're consistently paired. Yeah, I'm trying to trying to imagine that like moving in this space is like performing an operation. Sure. To change these three symbols instead of it being just Hey, no clues, no back seating. Nice. Yeah. Boom. Oh wow. Ghosted. Ghosted. Okay. Oh, thank you, Ghosty. Wow, Ghosty reminded me that I have to leave. Um, yep, I'm I'm headed out. Good luck. I'm All so right. sorry. You have to delete your game now. You better know, uninstall really, it. And also, I'm shame. sorry. We have to cancel the oh, series of shows oh. now. Look at this. I I had this at the top a bunch of times in a row. Bye, Bye Lee. Bye. Bye. I won't break the setup. <laughs> thank you. I mean, did you see this when I kept going up? I just got like a repeating shape. E, I, other I. What the fuck was e, that? E, I. Oh, E, I, I, I. The hell, three I's in a row? Okay, so here, here's what I'm going to surmise. I think that this is not a mappable locational thing, I think. So like, I, I feel like- Why do you think that? The, what I'm working with is nodes that we traverse appear to be stable. If we perform yeah. the same set of moves, we will move through the same set of nodes. Yes, and I think that if... I think that we it, this permits us to go infinitely in any direction, and it's performing some sort of operation on these nodes. That's what I mean. I, that's interesting. Because, like, I bet that we can just go left forever or go right forever i know? think you're right but i think that there are mappable loops right like i think if we mapped out oh we i could... guess yeah because if you're doing a transform yeah no because this because this is a group and the uh you know operation on elements in a group always result in another element in the group mm -hmm. so technically that means that that's fully mappable no matter what mm -hmm. But I think that um, my brain is wanting to view it as an operation to see, like, what this means. So we have, okay. like, these three symbols. And in the book... We have five symbols. So maybe we go in any direction of one of these symbols, 
Like, this is one of the symbols that was on there. That yeah. is one of the symbols, yeah. Uh, to the left is one of the symbols. Also to the right is also one of the symbols. Also to the right. So, right and left are so, both yeah. symbols. Right and left are both symbols. What was the last symbol in here? It was a little E thing. Uh, up and left, I think, are both symbols. This is just one of the symbols in there. Up and right. Huh. Just hold this, make sure that I'm not missing something. Missing a thing. Oh, Despy, get off the screen. <laughs> Despy! Get so, I, I think that an option, although this, this sounds tedious, yeah. An option would be to map out this maze. Yeah. And if we were to do that, I think that would help us find the entrance again. Yeah. And presumably it would also help us find whatever else we're looking for in here because it seems to be totally mappable, right? So. Yeah. But that doesn't feel like the solution to a puzzle, and it also sounds annoying. Well, what I want to do here is I want to I want to observe that this. So it'd be better if we could solve it. Yeah. So like the the. But I this... don't know what the solution is. I think it's not. It a does imply of... to me that the solution doesn't require us to start at a specific place. Yeah. Because. In order to get to a specific place, we would have to essentially map the entire cave system. Which so, doesn't seem like what we need to do. Yeah, so, I mean, I think that, that there is the common idea, so, which is that this symbol here is connected to... We're looking for some to... kind of a solution that I've been is muted this not... entire time. Sorry, uh, my cat, when, when she paused, Oh, shit. She oh, no. Oh, I didn't button. realize. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so, so I think that the... Um, the logic, I think the incorrect logic is this symbol is connected to whatever symbol's on the other side of the door. Right, okay. Because, like, look, this leads to this um, strong armed guy doing this. Yeah, strong armed guy. Then we have E, and it's connecting to this triangle. Right. But I think that what is interesting to me is come over here. So I think that this symbol might be what this symbol is changing into. Like, so if we go to the right, this does something over to here. Because if we go through this side, we see this E is in that direction as well. See what I mean? Where it's like, if I go okay, through this so, on the all right, right. So the X, the X turns into an E. Yeah. Let's see if we can find some more X's. Can we prove that? Or can we uh, go up this way? Find more inductive proof e. of that, I guess. Yeah, sure. So okay, so, so this E should become. Nope. No. Hmm. That was interesting. <laughs> Implicitly, we kind of explored the idea that going into a tunnel marked with a symbol would have would determine sort of what kinds of symbols were on the other side, like holistically. Yeah. Um, and that didn't seem to work out especially well for us. Yeah. I think it's that there are three symbols and then you get to choose an operation, which is left up or right. And I think the symbol maybe, maybe doesn't matter. I think it just does an operation. It's, 
So you think that we are choosing left, right, or up on essentially the input of three different symbols, perhaps in order. I, I guess, yeah. Um, I mean, if they are ordered, then that's equivalent to choosing one of the three symbols, really. But if they're not ordered, then it's not. Hmm. Um. Oh shit, this is a room with all three of them in there. Yeah, those are all three of our five. Do we maybe need to find... So we haven't yet been able to explore a sequence of five rooms where we could follow this chain all the way through, right? Like, we've... we've we have gone from like the spring hatch mark Shit. to a room where we went to the 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 summer double e but then we couldn't find the next thing that we needed to do is the Can relation we... of these pages relevant so we need to go through a left hatch to the left and then through this we need to go up and then through this we need to go right and then through this we need to go left again what left yeah, so we need to like find a left hatch and then an up. I'm just I'm wondering if there this describes a particular sequence of five rooms, and we need to find that sequence of five rooms. And it's not just oh. an arbitrary place where like every time we go through a uh, a, a hash uh, mark one, it's gonna lead us to the right place. But there is a sequence of these five in a row somewhere. I hate that idea. I don't think that's it because that would require us finding a specific location. Um, and even, and then it not being frankly that interesting once we found it. So uh, that doesn't seem right. I'm just kind of throwing stuff out. Yeah. So I'm wander around until I can find a, I'll find one of our good friends, the little hashies. This game just like really is not helping me. I mean, damn, I. This is a big cave. See, this is why I think that there is some sort of operation happening. <sighs> Left. I mean, I can I can understand Wait, that, up, but it would be left up, up, no. I literally thought I had it. I literally fucking thought I did it. Did I not do it? You're saying that that thinking about this in terms of performing an operation on these three symbols is predictive of what the next set of three symbols is going to be. Yeah, and I, what happened is I went, okay, so here is, here is this. So I'm actually just going to go hash. So I think if you go like this... And then the, the, literally the symbol isn't anywhere in sight. Right. Fuck. All right, so... So, okay, I, I don't know what to do with this. Is it possible that we are ascribing a directionality to these symbols that isn't appropriate? Like, to, do, could these symbols not signify the three directions the way that we think that they do. Yeah, I'm so like that's basically what you've been saying. Yeah. Yeah. I just I don't know that I buy it. Like they are the way they're placed is really clear. Hmm. So we're a little bit over time. Do you want to go for just a few more minutes? I can, that's fine. Yeah, I don't I don't do anything. <laughs> 
I tomorrow uh, my students are all giving presentations, so I don't need to make a lecture for them. Easy. God, being a professor is just totally hackable. <laughs> Sometimes. Sometimes it's not. <laughs> I also have like 36 projects that I need to grade, so. Well, everyone gets an A. <laughs> All right, can you can you draw some of these symbols? We got E, we got hedron, we have I, the square. Thing is I need like a giant piece of paper. I think Hold there's on. only seven. Because we oh, have, you just want me to draw the symbols? Yeah. So we have E, we have hedron, we have square. Wait, hold on. Which one is E? Because there's two of them that look like E's to me. Uh, this is E drippy E. Okay, drippy E. And then we got hedron. Okay, hedron. And we got we got square. Uh, and square. And I'm gonna call this X, or Xy. Okay, Xy. Yeah, and there's hedron, and then there's uh, triangle I. Triangle I. Ah, uh, yeah, and then there's flexor. And then there's flexor. Cause it looks like a guy doing this. He does. So, I mean, really, it's just these two are not, are the only not used ones. Can we follow, did, have you tried oh, just going I, down the path? Excuse me, got I. Oh, and then there's, then there's vertical I. Uh, and what was your quest? Can we follow ones, follow the symbols that don't appear in the letters? <laughs> No, not, um, yeah, kinda. Oh, there's also teacup. Oh, what is that one? Tea, tea, teacup. Yeah. Okay, teacup. Is this a different symbol? This weird one. No, that's the triangle eye. Well, so there's triangle eye. It has an extra line, you're saying? Like, there's a line yeah, it, missing from yeah, that it one? Looks like, and it's like the bottom of the triangle. But there are a couple, like the, um, the, the vertical eye that appears on the left sometimes is also curved in a weird way. I actually didn't write down the hatch one. We didn't... That oh yeah, sorry. We, we got we got hatchies. Hatchies. So there's nine symbols. Is that right? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah. Sometimes when you go left to right, it dumps you downward. Unless we're mm. at the entire bottom of the game. Oh, see, yeah, that, that, that was weird. Is when you go like left like this, and now you're down. And it level. comes down, yeah. See, now it's dumping us. I don't really know what to make of that. And so sometimes... Because that did the same thing, huh? It's sometimes when you go right and left. You come in from the top. But is that just an artifact of the fact that there's three directions? Yeah. Like, there's no other way to do that, really. Okay. Okay, wait, hold on. That's a symbol on the right. Yeah. Look to the left. That is a different symbol. Oh, yeah. So this is like Comet. So does this guy scream in every room? I feel like we went for a while where he didn't scream. Yeah. Yeah.
All right, Ghosty, we will stop in four minutes, no matter what. There we go. Okay. Is this on every screen? <laughs> sorry, sorry, Ghosty. Um. Well, okay, so like that. I uh, that the that thing. Yeah. Is that the same as? This one has a little hitch. It's got a little hitch. Okay. But it's not a whole different. It's it's not a, an extraneous line. Yeah. Okay. Oh, this connects to itself? Are we fucking serious? I literally have no fucking clue what I am doing. I'm pretty sure you tried going up a bunch of times in a row. Did did we encounter a loop? Yeah, we did. We did. Sorry. That's what I think. I forgot. So we have so XC like, hash flexor 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 teacup teacup uh, a comet e drippy comet square XC comet comet eyeball X. Eyeball triangle. See, this is what makes me think that there's some sort of operation happening. Because this doesn't feel like a repeating pattern. It doesn't. But before I thought it was. Did we just wander really far down? Yeah, I mean... It, I mean, it's possible that it is a mappable space that is procedurally generated. So it's infinite, despite being mappable. I think that's physically impossible, because if there is a pattern to the operation, there is there is a finite number of possible cave configurations. I, I'm saying there's not a pattern to the operation. I'm saying that it is a series of... No, so if you visualize it spatially... Right? Yeah. It could be that going right leads you into a room in which going right leads you into another room. And infinitely you can go to the right and never reach an end. It will continue generating rooms as far as you go. Yes. And those rooms are consistent. So if you travel back, you will get back to the beginning. Yeah. But there is no end to the rooms that you can map out oh, in that direction. I agree with that. And what I mean is that if you keep going, you will eventually reconnect to some other location is that necessarily true yeah because there's oh, there's a finite number of possible configurations of rooms just generally speaking there's a finite number only of only if they're non-repeating okay yeah yeah so i need to amend my statement which is that if going up down left or right is an operation on the okay. Yes. Like, we'll call each room a state, right? Each yeah, room. sure. So if I am operating on that state in some way by going up, down, left, or right, if an operation produces a consistent result, yes. then that necessarily means that, yeah, you will wind up looping back in there. I don't but, necessarily buy that premise as absolute, although I do think in practical terms it's likely to be correct. It, no, it, it has to be finite. Um, if you take, I don't see why it has to be finite. Because if you if you view, I gotta, I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna I'm gonna save and get back to the the pleasant. There we go. There, yeah, better. If, no. if yes, if if your assumption is correct, if if the if the traversal is an operation on the an three element. symbols, yeah. on an element, on a state. Uh, that means that those states 
are unique, right? Like, it, if you perform yeah. the same operation on the same state, you're going to get the same result. Yeah. I'm saying there's no reason why that has to be true. There's no reason why those states can't be uh, non-unique. That that if you were to map this out two-dimensionally, you could have the same set of symbols in two different rooms in two different places such that the operation you perform on them leads to a different result because they're spatially located next to different adjacent rooms. And if that's true, it could be infinite. Yes, that, that is necessarily true. Yes. Yeah, because like if, for instance, um, you went to the to the right and you labeled them room one, room two, room three, room four, room five, yeah. and that number combined with some other piece of information led to that configuration in the room plus the operation, well then, because one, two, three, four, five, six, seven are unique, then that means that they're you can you can create an operation where you will have an infinite number of non-repeating, non-looping things. But right. if it's if it's a proper group, and you have an yes. element in the group, and you take an element and you operate on the element to produce another element, then that necessarily creates loops. And 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 you're right. And I tend to think that that's correct just from a practicality standpoint. Like. Yeah. In backer quest, um, it'll just be a fucking infinite maze. Yes. Yes. We will definitely do that to you in back request. Mm. Oh, it's so good. Well, is it's kind of funny because this is the most annoying <laughs> type of thing that I love. God damn it. And I love that Lee left us saying I I really actually like this puzzle. Lee's like I definitely love, this is a great like, puzzle. Definitely a power. What the right fuck, there. Lee? Like I don't even know what that God is. damn it. Absolute douchebag. What an absolute bastard! <laughs> it's um, so I'm gonna I'm just gonna leave very abruptly because it's 9:30, so I should probably go to bed. Bye, Sean. This was a lot of fun. This was a lot of fun. Finger guns. Okay, bye bye. Oh wait, hold on. This is the game. This is the game. This is the game, babies. This is the game.